Hey guys! So yeah, this week, Man of the Week, Bruce Boshek. Man blog salute to you, sir. I'm one of your biggest fans, and I believe you to be one of my biggest fans. If you haven't checked out Bruce's channel, check him out. Of course, I'll leave a link down below. Uh, him and his wife, Karin, live in Germany. They've got a huge house that they've been working on. Uh, real close to finishing it up if they're not completely done with it. Uh, the last video they were working on the last room in it uh, and I believe it to be done um, if they can just keep from injuring themselves long enough to uh, get everything complete. But anyway, yeah, check out Bruce's channel. Anyway guys, what do coffee filters, Kevlar, circular saws, and life rafts all have in common. Grab yourselves a stogie, cup of coffee, we'll shoot the bowl, and I'll tell you. So anyway guys, yeah, remember last week I was telling you I'm gonna get a new truck? Well, I got me one did some shopping around, found exactly what I wanted, and uh, here's some footage of it. And there it is guys, there's what I ended up with. Searched all over town for the truck I wanted, ended up with an F-150, four-wheel drive, crew cab, actually they call this the super crew, I'm not sure why. But anyway, yeah, it sure is a far cry from that. Shoot, I could almost park that in the bed of that. And just carry a spare truck around with me. But yeah, guys, it's real nice. Real nice. I'm real happy with it. Picked it up for about 30% of or 30% off a of book value. I paid about 70% of what the book value is on it. Of course, like I said, it's four-wheel drive. It's got the uh, 5.4 Triton motor in it. Yeah, the only thing that scares me about that, guys, is the uh, tune-ups on it. Haven't quite figured out if I'm going to order that Lyle tool or uh, just pay somebody to do it. But yeah, definitely scared of the spark plugs on that thing. But anyway, guys, yep, that's what I got. It's a 2005 F-150. Yeah, and the only thing I'm real not big on on these, and I'm not sure why Ford did it, but in 04 when they changed the body style, they changed the stance of these. You can't really tell because our driveway is kind of sloped there. But the front sits about two inches lower than the back. And uh, they do sell a kit around 50 bucks. I can buy a kit, the hockey puck kit that just goes above the uh, strut and the spring, kind of raises that front end up. Uh, they call it a leveling kit. So, yeah, that'll probably be the first thing I do to this. But uh, other than that, guys, it really doesn't need anything. It's just a beautiful truck all the way around. I'll kind of walk around it and let you see it. Got the heavy duty tow hooks on the front. Yeah, my son and I played with it a little bit last night. Took it and put it in four wheel drive low just to see how low. And man, I'll tell you what, in four wheel drive low, this sucker would probably pull a house around. It's, uh, yeah, it's very powerful. A lot more powerful than that old beast there. So yeah, anyway guys, I just got done shooting that video of the truck about, I don't know, 10-15 minutes ago as you can tell. It's a beautiful Monday here in Kansas City. Uh, yeah, spring's here. I'm loving it. Loving the nice weather, loving the new truck. Well, new to me truck. Nine year old truck, but it's still brand new compared to that old hunk I was driving. But, yeah, I can't complain about that old Ranger. That thing served me well for a long time. Uh, probably less than $2,000 invested in it total. And, yeah, I drove it for three, four years. So I can't complain a bit about that thing. It got me point A to point B many, many days. 
Never failed to start on me. Probably one of the most reliable vehicles I've ever had. Which is why I'm really hesitant to get rid of it. But yeah, I'm going to have to sell it off. I don't, don't want to take up a whole bunch of driveway room with something that I don't really need. But anyway, that is what it is. But yeah, guys, this month uh, we're wrapping up March. And March was National Women's Month men love our women and uh, by Google Analytics I found out that uh, 86 percent of my views to the man blog are women um, surprise surprise I don't know if if they're just watching to spy on us or what but no I'm just kidding uh, I appreciate all my viewers men women little boys little girls I don't care if you're watching my videos and laughing and learning something or whatever more power to you but anyway guys this week or yeah I wanted to uh, pay homage to women and uh, what is it that a coffee filter and Kevlar and a circular saw and a life raft all have in common those were all invented by women the circular saw dates back all the way to 1810 guys a uh, female invented the circular saw. She was watching a couple of guys use the, uh, you know, the big huge saw that they used to use back in the day to cut logs. And she noticed that uh, with the teeth being faced one direction, that half of their motion was wasted. So she decided that a circular blade would be the answer, and we still use them to this day. How cool is that, man? The circular saw was invented by a lady. Very cool. But anyway, so yeah, this week the man blog salutes women. We all love you guys. So yeah, as we're wrapping up March and coming into April, um, April, 51 years ago, um, anybody that uh, is big on automotive history or a car guy definitely knows what happened 51 years ago in April. And the time machine's going to take us back there now check this out guys y'all have a good one and we'll talk to you later coming april 17th the unexpected the new ford mustang brilliant new kind of car a new generation of Fords for the new breed of Americans who want stick shift action and room for four. Who collect sports car badges and trading stamps. Who want the elegance of a European touring car and till now have to settle for basic transportation. This is for them. This is Mustang. With an unexpected variety of options, Mustang is the one car that's designed to be designed by you. Get ready to meet the unexpected April 17th at your Ford dealers. Mustang is only days away. You know these people. They're the go ones, the exciting ones, the young ones. Millions of them. They're all around us. Bright, charming, attractive, vibrant. With a whole new concept of tomorrow. They have pace, judgment, unmistakable flair. Ford knows they search for the unexpected. Ford has it. The Ford Mustang. <laughs>